Hi, this is Shubham from Moni Studio, and today in this podcast, we're gonna discuss about option grey for so five factors, which are delta, gamma, theta, rho, and vega, which are technically considered as a key factor for valuations of options. If you want to read full article about this, then the link of the article is provided in description. Also, if you want to watch a quick summary video of a less than 90 seconds, then subscribe to our YouTube channel Moni Studio. Now let's discuss the basic question: What is Option grid. A grid is a symbol assigned to a various risk characteristic that an option position has. The most common grids used include delta, gamma, theta, rho, and vega, which are the first partial derivatives of an option pricing model. Grids are used by option traders and portfolio managers to understand how their operations for options investment will behave as a price moves and to hedge their positions accordingly. Now let's understand each of these Greeks one by one. The first Greek is a delta. Beginning options traders sometimes assume that when a stock moves rupees one, the cost all option based on that script will move rupees one. That's pretty silly when you think about it. The option usually cost much less. Then the stock. Why would you reap the same benefits as if you own the stock? Besides, not all options are created equally. How much the option price changes compared to a move in a stock price depends on the option strike price related to the actual price of a stock. So the question is, how much will the price of an option move if stock move by rupees one? Delta provides the answer. So delta is the amount an option will move based on the rupee change in the underlying stock. If the delta of an option is ru- 0.5 in theory if the stock move rupees 1 then the option price should move approximately 0.5 rupees if a delta is 0.25 of a option then it should move by 0.25 rupees if the delta is 0.75 then option price should move 0.75 rupees and this is how a direct relationship between this since all call option represents the ability to buy the stock the delta of call will always be a positive number but option of other hand have a delta with a negative numbers for puts so this is about a delta now discuss what is the gamma gamma measures how fast a delta changes for small change in underlying stock price that is you can consider as a delta of a delta the options gamma is measure the rate of change in its delta the gamma of option is expressed as a percentage and reflect the change in a delta in response to one point moment of underlying stock price like the delta gamma is consistently changing even with a tiny moment of underlying stock price it generally is at its peak value when the stock price is near to the strike price of a option and decreases as the option goes deeper into out of the money option that are very deeply into or out of the money have a gamma value close to zero example suppose if the stock xyz limited currently trading at rupees 47 there is a fep 50 call options selling for rupees 2 let's assume it has a delta of 0.04 and gamma of 0.01 if the stock price move up by 1 rupees to rupees 48 then the delta will be adjusted upward by 10% 0.4 to 0.5 however if the stock trade down trade by rupee 1 that is rupees 46 then the delta will decrease by 10% that is 0.3 i know that these examples will be very difficult to understand so it is advisable to go through the article the link of the article is provided in description for the example purpose the third key factor is a theta the change in the option price gives a one day decrease in the time of expiration is a theta basically it measures the time decay the theta value indicates how much value of options price will diminish per day with all other factors being consistent if a stock option has a theta value of -0.012 it means that it will lose 1.2% a day such option contract will lose 2.4% over a weekend the nearer the expiration date the higher the theta and further away the expiration date the lower the theta for example a call option 
with a current price of rupees 2 and the theta decay of 5% will expire in a drop price of 5 paisa per day so in 2 days the price of option would fall to 1.9 rupees the fourth key factor of a greek is rho rho is the change in option price given a per 1 percentage change in the risk free interest rate it is a sensitivity of option to value a change in interest rate example if an option or options portfolio has a rho of 0.1.7% then for every percentage point increase in interest rate the value of option increases by 0.017 rupees however it is not normally needed for calculation for most option trading strategies the fifth greek is a vega the options vega is measure of an impact of a changes in the underlying volatility of option price specifically the vega of an option expresses the change in the price of a options for every 1% change in underlying volatility option tend to be a more expensive when volatility is higher the whenever volatility goes up the price of an option goes up and when volatility drops the price of option will fall therefore when calculating a new option price due to a volatility changes we add the vega when volatility goes up but subtract it when volatility fall for example a stock xyz is trading at rupees 46 in may and a june 50 call is selling at rupees 2 let's assume that vega of option is 0.15 that of underlying volatility is a 25% in this situation if the underlying volatility increase by 1% to 26% then the price of an option should rise by 15 rupees divided by 100 so the ultimate price will be 2 rupees 15 paisa if you want to understand these example properly then please read through our article the link of article is provided in description Now let discuss what are the bottom line over here. Greeks are used by option traders and portfolio managers to understand how their options investment will behave as a price moves and to hedge their position accordingly. The most common Greek use include delta, gamma, theta, rho, vega, which are the key element for the position and hedging. If you want to read full article about this, the link of article is provided in description. Also, if you want to Watch a quick summary video of less than 90 seconds and subscribe to our YouTube channel Monistu. Over here, Shubham from Monistu signing off. Thank you.